Hi everybody, my name is Katrina. Welcome to KMD Lifestyle. So I am, <laughs> I'm so tired. I just finished, um, I just finished doing my ASOS haul, like my second one I think it is, my second official one. Um, and this is like the first time I tried on half of that stuff. And um, it was it was tiring. <laughs> it was tiring. I feel like they're always tiring. Like the um, the halls are always tiring because you're like doing the camera and running to get the clothes. Put the clothes on, make sure they look decent for the camera, and then come back and get anyway. What? Anyway, so if I do a whole lot of huffing and puffing, that's why. Um, but give me one second. Let me get my paper. Okay, so um, as you all know, if you follow the channel or have been watching the um, or have been watching any of the videos, I uh, just recently went to um, Hawaii and I talked about it in my in my Hawaii video about how like I when I go on vacation. I don't like shop on vacation, but I think my camera's a little lopsided. Anyway, um, but before I go on vacation, I get like, I don't know, I get I get the bug and the itch to shop, and so I like do all this shopping for the vacation, so I'm like cute on vacation and stuff like that. Um, and so, needless to say, I have a lot of haul videos that I need to get out quickly because I bought a ton of stuff before I went to Hawaii. Um, depending on what it was, like, it's specifically for ASOS, it was only, like, one or two items that was actually for Hawaii, and then, like, everything else just got added on because I was on the site buying everything. Um, so, I'm just gonna review it all, and then eventually I'll get to, like, I'll get all the haul videos out. Um, there's only really this one and, like, two other ones. Um, but I'll get to them. So... Let's just go down the list. I'm pretty sure I just tried on all of this stuff. Yeah, I think. Um, so, the first thing on my list is the ASOS Design Tall Wide Leg Trousers with Pleat Detail. Um, so, ASOS kind of sticks has like a few different designs they kind of stick to maybe over a couple seasons and they just like change the colors or rotate the colors out and so I had this pair of pants in black and white um and yeah they're both on here I just ordered them in khaki and navy so you'll see the 14 in the navies and the 16 in the khakis um and you'll see the difference. There's like a huge difference in the fit, like a huge difference. They almost feel like they're two sizes like apart, but they're not. Um, So 16's too fitted for me. I could actually probably wear them out, but they're too fitted for me. 
Um, I, I mean, 14. Um, so I would probably just do the 16 and get them altered. I actually had to like keep myself from going back on ASOS and like ordering all the stuff that didn't fit the way I wanted it to in a different size like right now. Um, I was like, no, I need to get this video out and then I'll go back and do all my ordering. Um, so those are those two. This other thing, I, this other item I also had in like every color, not really in every color, but in every color. Um, I think I bought two of them, so I have a total of five colors. It is the, uh, I'm gonna skip like the whole ASOS tall design part of the description because it's in every one of them. So anyway, um, it's called the tall woven peg trouser with OB tie. Um, and I've reviewed these before. And I'm gonna read, but I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I bought two pair, and I already have three pairs. So I already have the navy black and gray pair. Um, I love these pants. It, they're so. I, I mean, I say they're versatile, but they're not like. Yeah, you can you can dress them up and you can dress them down. Like you can put on heels, or you can put on flats, or you can put on like a tank top, or you can put on like. Um, something a little more dressy for, for work or something like that. Um, so I love these pants and typically, if you haven't figured this out already, if I find one item that I love, I literally buy that, that item in every color, just because that's how I am. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing, but anyway, I did that. Um, and I have these, these in, this thing does not say the colors. That's going to make me mad. Um, I'm going to insert the colors maybe with the clips or something like that. But one pair, I believe, is uh, khaki and one pair is like an olive color. And I'm not sure if khaki and olive are the, are the colors that they use like um, on the website, but I'll insert the actual colors from the website. But those are the two one, two pairs that I have. Um, and I'm looking at them because they're sitting over there because I just took them off. But uh, I, I like both of them. They both fit the sizing for ASOS, I would say is like the same for every item that you purchase. So like I have these five items, they fit the same across all five items. And that's not necessarily the case with a lot of other places. I know Old Navy is, I'm not gonna throw them under the bus, but Old Navy is like that. Like I can wear a 20 in one item and a 12 in another item. And it's just, it's ridiculous. So it makes it hard for people like me who constantly order offline instead of in the store because I'm tall. So anyway. ASOS is pretty like legit with their sizing and consistent so um yeah that was that's the first four items that I have and then I think I'm just gonna go down the list from there because I kind of hopped all over with those four items um the fifth item that I have is called the tall cute sweat that's what it says on this paper but I'm pretty sure there's more to that title um this is a white sweatshirt, it's like a plain white crew neck sweatshirt.
pretty simple person when it comes to my style. And I've always wanted like to wear the little crew nets with jeans and stuff like that for like a cute casual look, but I never could find crew nets that are long enough for me or sweatshirts that are long enough for me in the arms. So I ordered this one. Um, what I will say about this item, let me grab this mic. What I will say about this item is that it's thinner than you probably expect it to be. Like when you say sweatshirt, you probably think like thick and warm. It's not necessarily all that thick, um, but I think it'll be good for like fall time or you know winter layered with some things. Um, Cause I love this sweater because the um, sleeves, the sleeves are like long enough like like perfect maybe a little longer than perfect um but the torso is not too long like everything that i get i have to order tall because of my 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 arms but the torso is always too long for me and this sweatshirt if you have that issue then get this sweatshirt if you don't then you probably don't want to get this sweatshirt because the torso was like perfect for me and the arms were like perfect and i'm probably like not proportionate or something so yeah um the only other thing I would say is like, I paid, it doesn't even say how much I paid on here. I don't know how much they're running for. I have to look at my phone, but I don't want to mess with it. Um, but I want to say no more than $25 for the sweatshirt. And the sweatshirt is not like, it's not like the best quality. Like it's probably like better than a Fashion Nova Boohoo, but not ASOS quality. I don't know. I can't really say that because sometimes ASOS have some like uh, pieces that aren't as quality as others. Let's put it that way. But I'm totally keeping the sweatshirt. Um, if I pay twenty five dollars, it's worth it because the fit is perfect for me. Um, the quality may not be the best, but it's a sweatshirt. So I don't know. Um, Needless to say, I'm keeping that sweatshirt and I'm purchasing some more. I'm pretty sure they have a black one and a pink one. Um, but now now I know that it's going to fit, I'm going to order some more. Though, now that I think about it, I'm probably not going to keep that sweatshirt. I'm going to return it and get a smaller size. Um, I got my normal size 14, but it's too big in like the waist area. The sleeves are long enough. The shoulder fits pretty good. The length of the torso is good, but um, the body of the sweatshirt is too big for me. So I'm gonna probably try to order a size down if they have it. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, the next one is a tall, not front body kind midi dress in palm print. Um, so this was for Hawaii. Uh, this is a midi dress with, it's like a pink and green, uh, with pink being the base color and green being the palm trees. And it has two little ties in the front. Um, this is really cute. Um, this one is thin as well. It's not actually, it's, it's kind of, yeah, it's kind of thin, but it's a palm tree dress, so it's a summer dress, so there's really nothing wrong with it being thin. Um, In Hawaii, the way that I wore this dress was over, um, and I don't think I took any pictures, was over a swimsuit. So I wore it kind of like a cover up, but kind of like an outfit. So it was like, I'm going out for the day in Hawaii. I don't know if I'll end up at a beach or in the pool somewhere. So I'm just gonna put a swimsuit under it. And that worked out really well because I hadn't figured out, and I still haven't, um, I might have, one of my homegirls told me I'm rambling a whole lot. But the dress itself has the two knots in the front, but it's open. So if you don't have the proper, um, and it's and it's spaghetti strap. So if you don't have the proper uh, 
foundation for your breasts, then you just all out here. Um, and so I put that dress on like at one point in time that I was gonna wear it like as a true outfit without like um, a swimsuit under it. I was like, oh no, I can't do this because I don't have the, like I had, I had some other like bra solutions that wasn't working out. So I didn't have the correct foundation to wear under this dress. So I wore it with a swimsuit and it was like an olive green colored swimsuit, so it worked out perfectly. It was really cute. If I took a picture that day, I'll insert it, but I don't think I took any pictures that day. Um, but just leave the video, and you'll clearly be able to see my bra. Um, but yeah, it's cute. I'm keeping it. I've already worn it. It's cute. So, that was that. Um... What's this one? Oh, I already talked about that one. Oh, tall trim detail um, beach play suit. So I completely forgot I bought this and didn't take it to Hawaii, which I bought way too much stuff for Hawaii, but this was basically um, a beach cover up romper. It's thin, um, but it's cute. It's really open in the front. Um, and initially I thought it was too big because um, it's, it has like a low back situation and that was like falling it was like falling down and it was like not staying but I didn't realize that um there's a tie in the front that you like pull tight and then it pulls the back also but the, the 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 chest area is still really open so that's the only thing about that so you really can't wear it as anything else I have another romper a black romper um that I may have reviewed I can't remember from ASOS that you can you can legit wear that as like an outfit um, and it's not just the beach cover up though I wear it like that sometimes This one is like a true beach cover up, unless you're cool with like being out here, <laughs> you know? Um, nothing wrong with that if that's your thing and go for it. But I'm keeping it, it's cute. Uh, I'm pretty sure it was cheap, I don't know, but like always I'll insert like how much I paid for it and we'll link to everything. Um, the next one is called Sexy Wrap Midi Body Contrast. This thing is so cute. Like it's thin as well. Um, but it's like a total like one piece situation where you put your arms through it and you wrap it around. Um, one side goes through this hole on the other side and the other side comes around here tied in the back. It's really cute. It's really sexy. But this is also one of the things I actually think I'm returning it because um, I, don't, I don't think that dress was intended. You know what? I'm not going to say that because people can wear whatever they want to. For me, I have too many rolls and too much chest and too much butt to wear that dress. like um even with like the solutions that i'm gonna get that i can wear with like i can wear clothes without a bra this shows way too much of my too much cleavage or too much of my breasts um and you'll see it um but it also like i don't even know that i can wear like um foundation pieces or proper undergarment or shapewear whatever you want to call it shapewear under that 
to smooth out any of the lumps and bumps because it's so like it's open in the front um, and the material is so thin that it doesn't help like conceal anything so any anyway you'll see in the video I'm returning it it's sexy and if you're like thin or okay with like you know not looking as smooth in your clothing then you know that might be something for you it's really cute I love it I want to keep it but I don't think that I'll be able to wear, I don't think that I'll actually wear it because I don't think I'll be able to wear anything under it to make me feel a little bit more comfortable secure and smooth um so that that that's that one um so I bought these tailored linen cigarette trousers these are cute these are like the OB trousers but without the tie in the front um and they're linen and they're pink they're so cute. Um, the only thing is the tapering in the waist is not as good as the OB tie um, pants. So you'll have to, I, I will have to get those tailored. Um, you'll see in the video that the, I have the, the gap in the back, the waist gap in the back, or the butt gap or hip gap, whatever you call it, the gap in the back, um, which I have in almost every pair of pants that I would buy. So I have to get those tailored. But other than that, those pants are so cute. I wanted to wear them in Hawaii. I brought them to Hawaii. I was excited because I was like, these are pink and they're linen, perfect for Hawaii. I get to Hawaii, I put them on. Now I'm telling you, like I literally haven't tried on these things, these items until today. I get to Hawaii, put them on, and I'm like, oh, gotta get these tailored. Can't wear these today, so. Needless to say, I wasn't able to wear them when I wanted to, but they're cute and I'm keeping them. I'm gonna get them tailored and then I'll wear them. I need to get them tailored soon because uh, I don't have much more time to wear them. Or it'll be like next year before I wear them. I don't know. Um, and then I have two more items, I think. Oh, okay, so I have, um, it's called a V-neck blouse. So it's a long sleeve, a long sleeve V-neck blouse button down blouse um I liked it I'm not sure about it because it's too small for my breasts like you know the little action where you push your arms back and like you get the it doesn't gape open though that's the one thing it doesn't gape open but it's tight there um but it's loose everywhere else or fits well everywhere else it's long enough in the sleeves um Of course, it's too long in the torso, but I feel like with ASOS button downs, they're always too long in the torso for me. Um, and I know that if I go up to a 16, it's going to be too big, so I'm probably just going to keep it and deal with the boob situation. It's not too bad because it doesn't gap open, so I'll probably just keep that. Um, other than that, it's just like a basic white shirt button down that I would wear to work or something. And then the last thing I have is the tall eco swing, echo eco swing cami um, with double layer. That was really cute. Um, it's just a spaghetti strap, 
double, I guess it's double layered, double layered uh, white, kind of like a dressy pink. It's like a smooth, the material is like smooth. I don't know what kind of material it is, but it's like satin almost. Um, I don't think I'm going to keep that. It fits well, but I don't think I'm going to keep it because it's long in the torso. And I could probably buy that in a regular size because it doesn't have any sleeves on it or anything like that. So it'll probably fit me really well with just like a regular size. So that's that. There's really nothing else to say about that. I'm probably going to return it and just get it in regular sizes. But it was cute. <laughs> I liked it. You'll see it in the video. Um, other than that, that's it. I am, I know I rushed through that, but I am trying my best to like keep these short. They like, I reviewed, I don't know how many items. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven items. Um, and I don't know how much time that is. It's probably like at 20 minutes. And that's without the video so I am like though I felt I feel like I rambled a little bit um, and I feel like I like sped through some things I'm just trying to keep it like short and sweet because I know y'all don't be wanting to listen to all of this <laughs> um, you just want to hear about the you know just about the clothes or whatever so that's what I'm gonna do the one thing I will reiterate if you haven't watched any of my ASOS um, hauls I love ASOS I love ASOS because number one ASOS get all my money um, but number one, ASOS is like super consistent in their sizing. So after you order from them a couple times, you can you'll realize what size you truly are, and you can just look at the item and be like, oh, I need to size up or size down, um, because they're really consistent, and I love that about. Them. And that's I think that's mainly with their brand clothes, because they also sell like some other brands that aren't there so that sizing might be a little different but ASOS brand clothes like their sizes are really consistent the other thing that I love about ASOS is like you get free two day shipping I think it is um most of the time I think you have to use a code like USA Express or something like that it's like I feel like that's always the code but it, most of the time you can always get free two day shipping if not it's going to be like free two, three to five days so I'm going to quickly try to hurry up because my camera is disrespectful and just cut off on me. Um, but I was just saying that I love ASOS because the sizing is consistent um, across all ASOS designs. Um, I think I said all of that. And I was saying that the shipping is good because you get um, free two day shipping over a certain amount and it's called Express USA. It's a promotion that they always offer pretty much. And then if not, I guess if you don't like meet their minimums, then you get three to five day shipping. And then you also get free returns, which is like, to me, the dopest part. Um, and that's all I wanted to say. My camera was being disrespectful. Um, but yeah, so many more ASOS hauls to come. Um, I'm actually in the process of ordering more clothes right now which is freaking ridiculous but I always have to exchange clothes and then when I exchange clothes I end up ordering more clothes so um that's it um on my ASOS haul if you have any questions comments make sure you leave them below on the blog or um on YouTube either way I'll get to them as soon as I see them um thanks for watching thank you for tuning in bye bye <laughs>